Tonight we ride. What's going down, people? It's your boy Dreadus, the casual beast for the average gamer. Got some more planet side action for in front. Damn. I am not doing a retake of this shit, so that's just gonna stay in there. I got some more planet side two action for you. I'm on my TR alternate account. And yes, I am at the TR second home. Their first home is the warp gate, and the TR second home base is the crown. And I don't mean that in a good way. The problem is this. The TR have, ever since the first fucking tech test and the early stages of the alpha, you know, beta, whatever, way back for this game, TR has always been a random Zerg that will, they will, the crown is everything on Endar for some reason to TR players. And not so much veterans who, who, cause we all went through this shit during the beta, alpha, whatever. Um, but now newer players, you know, it's so hard to attack it, so easy to defend. But for some reason, TR just loves this fucking place. And that's why I call it the second home. Because TR will actually, and I, I'm sorry, I, to some of you watching this are TR fans, you can be mad, but you know I'm fucking right. The TR on a lot of servers, almost all of them, they will fucking camp, not camping like, I mean, you know, they're defending it, so I don't mean camp like, you know, like an asshole. But they will camp out at the crown, and they will stay there the entire fucking day. Sometimes two or three days, they'll hold the crown. They will give up the rest of the entire fucking map, except for, you know, their warp zone, which can't be taken, their warp gate. They will sacrifice the rest of the map as long as they hold the crown. <laughs> it's like the Alamo. As long as we hold the crown, we don't give a fuck about any of the other area. So I've seen VS take everything around it up to the warp gate and the and all the TR is just stacked at the crown. Fucking Sunder is everywhere and just I mean just crazy. Max is everywhere. And it's just funny. So anyway, um that's why th this video is kind of funny with that because you have to understand for some reason, the TR have just a super affection for the crown. Now, when I play on my normal account, my VS, nobody wants to go there. I mean, sometimes guys will give orders, you know, on the um, chat, you know, the crown. And most people will be like, no, like, we're not. Most of the outfits are like, uh-uh, we're going to avoid the crown. We don't want that shit. That, let TR have that. We don't care about the crown. We'll take everything else because they're all going to be at the crown. So, in effect, that's what makes this video kind of, you know kind of funny or, or worth posting because this was a day I was on my Austin TR account and I just spent the time up here just just sitting doing what TR normally does launching rockets you know fighting at the crown just chilling chilling and you know just chilling and uh, you know don't get me wrong it can be fun I understand why newer people do it it's just sad when you get like level 70s and 80s and shit that just sit at the crown all day you know, I mean, it's got to get boring after a while. But, you know, I did it too. I mean, you know, it's my alternate account. I didn't really give a shit. I more did it for to make a video. But um, it's a place that I normally avoid. But sometimes it can be there. And you can get kills and you can have some fun. You can definitely get your XP up um, being at the crown all the time. Because there's always the opportunities to heal, revive, drop ammo, you know, replenish maxes with ammo you know there's tons of XP to be gotten so a lot of people like to be there plus it's easily to defend that's the biggest thing it's easily defendable any effect um, let the rest of the video ride out it's always a lot of action at the crown though I mean it's not a boring place it's a lot going on but it's just a clusterfuck that's really been a big problem so uh, this is part one of two of this little crown series so um, let the rest of the video ride out enjoy peace